Well, I'm pleased to welcome none other than Yvonne Nelson to Focus on Africa. I was just telling you, I can't believe you haven't been on this program all this while, but thanks for joining us. You've been in so many movies. C can you remember how many? How oh, a lot. <laughs> Over a hundred. Over a hundred. You see, me. I mean, because I, I, I kind of like short counted. I was on mm. about 50 or 60 <laughs> or something like that. You know, uh, how's the, the movie industry in Ghana doing? Because for a long time, uh, it said you were playing catch up with Nigeria, but yeah. you seem to be standing on your own now. It's, it's a little slow. Mm -hmm. uh, too bad. It's a little slow because we're having so many issues with piracy and, and all of that. So, but some of us are, you know, we, we're keeping it going. I like it when you say some of us, because you've become mm. a, not only an actress now, but a, a producer, producer as well. A very passionate one. Brilliant. Yeah. And are you looking to move into film as against um, uh, home movies? Because I'm, I'm kind of like struggling with the fact that Africa, most, many African countries are still stuck in that home movie rut. Uh, don't blame us. It's funding. You know, the, the money isn't there. Mm -hmm. You know, some of us are still producing because of the passion and because of the kind of love we have for the industry. So if we have you know, appropriate and enough funding, yeah, I believe we'll get there. Brilliant stuff. I mean, like I said in my introduction of you there, you know, you've also got this civic side to you. You led this Doom Saw Must Stop um, campaign in May 2015, it was? Yes. Uh, you were com campaigning against power outages. <laughs> How did you come about that? Okay, so um, I was frustrated because the lights were constantly off all mm -hmm. the time. Um, I remember one evening I went on Twitter and I tweeted, Doom so must stop. And I realized it was trending. It trended for a week. Mm. And I decided to, you know, um, rally my friends together, go out there and let our voices be heard. And that's exactly what I did. So uh, I you know some people now say that you were, <laughs> the, you were the beginning of the downfall of your former president, uh, Mahama. Oh. Oh, wow, too bad. I, I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. But it was something that had to be addressed. And it, it was a great platform for you. I mean, so any plans to go into politics, perhaps? Maybe. It's you never done. know. You never know. Maybe in the future. Come on, give us, you know, something to, to go with. I'm still thinking about still it. Still thinking about yeah. it. Okay, so, so what next for you then? Um, I'm still producing. Mm -hmm. um, I just uh, uh, produced uh, my series, um, Heels and Sneakers. I just finished the season two, so I'm promoting that. I'm trying to help the younger ones, you know, okay. showcase their, their skills and talents in Ghana. That, that's always good. And what are you doing in London? I came to cool off. It's too warm in Ghana. <laughs> <laughs> you came to cool off in London yeah, yeah. during the, the winter. Now, uh, I mean, what, what's your your big ambition? Um, um, you know, in uh, career-wise, when it comes to acting, you know, are you hoping to do some collaborations with uh, with Hollywood, for instance? You know, it's been known to happen. Yes, yes. I've I've actually shot one project there, but it's not out yet. Um, but I I want to see my industry grow. I want to see the Ghanaian movie industry grow. So it will be my dream to you know to see us up there competing with Hollywood. Competing with them as against yes. working with them. Um, working with them, competing. You know. Just, just doing great stuff in, in, in Ghana. And you say you're working with, um, with, with young people. Any nice, young, exciting talent on the continent that, that you know you think we should be looking out for? Um, yes, a lot of them are in Ghana. Anytime I'm, I'm starting a project, I always organize auditions mm -hmm. because um, I was discovered by someone. So mm -hmm. I believe that's my little way in giving back to the younger ones. So I, I believe there are so many you know, talents in Africa, Nigeria and, and, and you know, Ghana. Some people said I must ask you. There are two questions that I must ask you. The ah. first one is, we've seen it happen in Nigeria where some of the big actresses have gone into music. Any plans to do that? No, I can't sing. <laughs> <laughs> if you can't, maybe you can rap. <laughs> Well, I used to rap when I was in high school, but there no, I'll just stick to my acting. There you go. And then, you know, um, somebody, this is none of my business, you don't have to answer it. <laughs> okay. You know. When are you getting married? That's from a lot of your fans. Mm, <laughs> soon. Maybe this year, you never know. Oh, is there somebody waiting in the wings? Yes. Oh, absolutely. So you've got the, the <laughs> scoop right here on Focus on Africa. She might be getting married uh, very soon. Listen, Yvonne, great to have you here on the show. Thanks for having me. Thank you very much. Thanks Appreciate for it. Me. Okay? Thank you very much.